Well, even though this year's election has come and gone, a man who coordinates the Indiana Tea Party says it's already time to start thinking about 2014. That's because Tea Party candidates this year didn't claim many seats in Congress to help break the gridlock. News Channel 15's Megan Royce has details tonight from Studio 15. The Tea Party wasn't happy to see the outcome of the election Tuesday night. They say now's the time to start looking for good candidates who could perform better two years from now. Indiana local Tea Party coordinator Emery McClendon has hope. Although Tea Party candidates didn't do well Tuesday night, McClendon says the Tea Party needs to buckle down. That means they need to find good candidates who could break the gridlock in the Senate come 2014. And if we want our values and the things that we believe in to become uh, back to uh, America, we need to put senators in the Senate that can work with Senator, uh, the people in the House. Republican and Tea Party backed Senate candidate Richard Murdoch was running for a seat in Congress this year. McClendon was surprised to see him fall to Democrat Joe Donnelly. I thought that even with the um, uh, statement that he made during the debate, I thought he would probably still win the election based on fiscal policies and um, uh, looking at the spending that our government is doing. Some Republicans may be wondering why they didn't get a majority in the Senate. IPFW political science professor Mike Wolf says there's a reason. They've had more Tea Party or more conservative uh, people challenge people in the last two cycles. And if you had had a more moderate person in those, they would be holding probably five seats maybe six. Wolf says the Republican Party should focus instead on recruiting more moderate conservatives. The consequence is that, uh, you know, they tend to maybe appeal more toward, toward the middle ground and where the more voters are. Now, despite the fact the Tea Party had a bad night Tuesday, McClendon seemed hopeful of the future of the Tea Party. Reporting in Studio 15, Megan Royst, News Channel 15.